Okay guys, today I'm going to teach you how to change your command module. Uh, so for example, this is my build, this is the first part of my super tanker, and um, the second part I needed the same thing, exactly the same thing, but I needed, instead of a manned one, I needed an unmanned module. Now how the hell are you supposed to do this? Obviously there you can't currently do this, you can't delete the command pod. If uh, I do try to move all the stuff, I can't. I can't delete the command pod. So there's no real official way of doing this, but uh, the unofficial way you can uh, do some stuff. So first thing, what you're gonna need to do is uh, create a new thing. So we're gonna create a new thing, and what do you want to replace it by? So we're gonna replace it by, let's say, this one, uh, this probe. So what I'm gonna do this is call it probe test like this I want to get the name of the probe and then I'm gonna save it so I know now it's called probe test so what I'm gonna do now is close the game and quit the game now once I quit the game I'm gonna go into the KSP directory and I'm gonna open up my uh, save my actual uh, save file which is I called it the monocopolis space program and ships and then I'm gonna find my probe test I'm gonna open it up using uh, text uh, notepad whatever and then I'm gonna look for my probe now my probe part is what you could do is you could search for probe and you'll see my probe part is called probe core OCT find next and there's nothing else so literally my probe part is called this okay this is my probe part and this is the actual location so what you're gonna do is you're gonna copy the probe part name I'm gonna copy it and then I'm gonna open up what I need to change it on so now remember in part one I needed to change that to uh, to the unmanned pod so now again I'm gonna look for my probe here it is and I'm just gonna change the name of the probe to the different probe name to the unmanned probe again leave the numbers alone because that's the location now just to be sure I'm gonna search if there's any other probe names no that's not it so then I'm gonna hit file save okay and now I'm gonna run the game again so let's go to KSP and run the game and I'll see you guys in the game now when I'm back in the game, of course, I'm going to just resume my space program. And I'm going to load part 1. Loading part 1. And let's move up and let's see what happened. You see here it is? It's been switched. Of course, uh, the space, it still left the space in general, because remember it was a man probe, so it was larger. So if you do have the space, it'll just move it away, which isn't a big deal. I can just move it back on top of that. But uh, this pretty much should help you in terms of changing your probes. You can do this with any anything you want. You can switch items and stuff. As long as you know the actual name of the item or uh, the actual structure, you can switch it now. Uh, I don't take any risk, so I suggest you back it up. Sometimes it might crash in case you are, let's say, replacing a part where there's not enough space around it or you're moving the actual uh, exact location of the item, it'll cause it to, to crash. So uh, don't change those numbers, remember, beside the actual name. Just change the name, and as you see, it did uh, give it, uh, give me uh, just to replace the actual probe with the thing. And now if I do load part 2, that's exactly what I did, and then I made the part 2 probe. And you see what I did with the part 2 probe? Of course, I had the unmanned pod. Let it load up. Let's go all the way up. And I just did my own thing. I have the exact same ship with my unmanned pod. And of course, I moved it down. And this is the part 2 for my part 2 probe. Now, you can obviously do this and you can change all the probes uh, that you want. You know, making a primary, secondary. Now, let's go back to the actual uh, text document itself. Here we are back at the thing itself. I am trying to get back to my thing. Now, uh, I created the probe test just to see the name of the probe. Now, keep in mind, if you have more probes, I do believe the command pod is uh, the actual main command pod. So if you start searching for probes, you will probably have another probe name somewhere, I don't know, let's say down here or something, whatever. And it won't be called a command pod. So make sure you know which is the main one. So like that, I could switch, let's say, one of my unmanned probes, let's say it was here, unmanned probe, whatever, and I can switch it with this one. So I can change this one to a manned probe to be as my main command pod, and the other one as an unmanned probe to be my secondary one. So that's what you can do. Of course, if your ship has more, as mentioned before, you will have more names. But generally speaking, the first part is usually the main, main command pod, which is the main one. So that's what I just did. So I hope it helps you out. As always, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, like it, and leave your comments down below in case you'd like me to do something else. Take care. Bye.